our main objective is to uh, grow them as uh, real genuine Tibetan with a very strong base in their culture, religion and language. And then another the mission of uh, Tibetan Children's Village is uh, we want our children uh, to be able to look after themselves, to stand on their own feet. It's a very sudden decision made by my parents, especially my father. It's one of my elder brothers of here, and he, he was studying over here in the uh, 1990s. He suggested me if I, if I can, uh, if I could get here, it's, here I can get a good opportunity to study. I feel it is just home, especially in when I am living in Suja. There's uh, um, all the students come from Tibet, and we have the same way of thinking and some way of doing. At the time, yeah, he feel very lonely, yeah, and he uh, he feel yeah, every day he's crying and his health is not that much good, so he was admitted in our dispensary. So right now he's okay. Now he's almost one and a half months in baby home. He feels okay. I came here and to, uh, come to know what Tibet is and to uh, and know the uh, rich culture and the history and what kind of uh, exile government is uh, set over here in Dharamsala. It feel me as if, uh, as if I'm a uh, citizen of a great nation in my life. I want them to finish their work, their school, and after they finish their work, I will try to get into the Tibet 
and then I will stay my parents and uh, take care of them and uh, stay in Tibet and uh, to um, or to stay, to help the peoples in Tibet.